The book that started the guerrilla marketing change has been updated for the 21st century. It is now bigger and has all new information. With his Take No Prisoners method to finding clients, Jay Levinson's book, Guerrilla Marketing, changed the way small business owners thought about marketing. Levinson's theory is a new way to learn about market share and how to get it. It is based on hundreds of good ideas that work. In this completely updated and expanded fourth edition, Levinson gives small businesses a new arsenal of tools for success. These include strategies for marketing on the internet, including when and how to use it, tips for using new technology like podcasting and automated marketing, programs for targeting prospects and building repeat and referral business, and management lessons for the age of telecommuting and freelance workers. Guerrilla marketing is the marketing guide for entrepreneurs, and every small business owner should have a copy. Guerrilla marketing, easy and cheap strategies for making big profits from your small business, is a book by Jay Conrad that gives small businesses with few resources creative and useful marketing ideas. There are 19 chapters in the book, and each one talks about a different part of guerrilla marketing. Chapter 1. Introduction to Guerrilla Marketing This part explains what guerrilla marketing is and how it is different from traditional marketing. Conrad says that to make effective guerrilla marketing efforts, you need to be creative, come up with new ideas, and be willing to take risks. Chapter 2. The Guerrilla Marketing Mindset This part talks about the mindset needed for guerrilla marketing to work, such as a focus on the customer, a willingness to try new things and try again, and a commitment to always getting better. Chapter 3. Guerrilla Marketing Research this section talks about the value of market research in guerrilla marketing and how to do things like survey customers, look at competitors, and find a business's unique selling proposition, USP. Chapter 4. Guerrilla Marketing Weapons This part talks about the different ways to use publicity, advertising, promotions, and personal selling as guerrilla marketing tools. Conrad gives useful advice and examples on how to use each tool well. Chapter 5. Guerrilla Marketing on a Shoestring Budget This part shows you how to use social media, make content, and get free publicity to make guerrilla marketing campaigns that work well with limited resources. Chapter 6. Guerrilla Marketing in Action This part gives real-world examples of successful guerrilla marketing campaigns, including how small businesses have used creativity and innovation to stand out in crowded markets. Chapter 7. Guerrilla Marketing on the Internet This part goes over the basics of online marketing, such as search engine optimization, SEO, pay-per-click advertising, PPC, and email marketing. Conrad gives tips and plans for using the Internet to reach and keep people interested. Chapter 8. Guerrilla Publicity this part talks about the power of publicity in guerrilla marketing, including how to make newsworthy stories, pitch them to journalists, and use social media to reach more people. Chapter 9. Guerrilla Advertising This part goes over the basics of advertising in guerrilla marketing, such as how to make ads that work, choose the right media channels, and figure out how well ads are doing. Chapter 10. Guerrilla Promotions this part shows you how to use contests, giveaways, and other incentives to attract and keep customers. Chapter 11. Guerrilla Direct Mail This section talks about the use of direct mail in guerrilla marketing, including how to make effective direct mail campaigns, choose the right target group, and measure the success of direct mail efforts. Chapter 12. Guerrilla Networking this section talks about the value of networking in guerrilla marketing and how to build relationships with customers, partners, and other businesses in the area. Chapter 13, Guerrilla Trade Shows. This section shows you how to use trade shows as a platform for guerrilla marketing, including how to make successful displays, talk to people at the show, and measure the success of your efforts at the show. Chapter 14, Guerrilla Telemarketing. This part goes over the basics of telemarketing and guerrilla marketing, such as how to write good scripts, deal with objections, and figure out how well telemarketing campaigns are doing. Chapter 15, Guerrilla Sales. This part talks about how important sales are in guerrilla marketing and how to make good sales presentations, deal with objections, and close deals. Chapter 16, Guerrilla Joint Ventures. 
This section goes over the basics of joint ventures in guerrilla marketing, including how to find possible partners, negotiate deals, and measure the success of joint venture efforts. Chapter 17, Guerrilla Customer Service. This part talks about the importance of customer service in guerrilla marketing, including how to create a customer-centered culture, deal with complaints and feedback, and measure customer satisfaction. Chapter 18, Guerrilla Marketing for Service Businesses. This section has tips and strategies for service businesses, like how to build effective service packages, price services, and use referrals to get new customers. Chapter 19, Guerrilla Marketing for Retail Businesses. This part gives retail businesses tips and strategies that are made just for them, like how to make good displays, use sales promotions, and figure out how well their marketing is working. Conrad uses real-world examples and case studies to show how the ideas and tactics he describes work in the real world. He also says that to make effective guerrilla marketing efforts, you need to be creative, come up with new ideas, and be willing to take risks. The main goal of the book is to help small businesses win in competitive markets by giving them marketing strategies that are easy to use and don't cost a lot of money. Thanks for watching our Amazon book review. If you found our review helpful and you're interested in checking it out for yourself, we've included a link to it in the description below. By clicking on that link, you'll not only get more details about it on Amazon, but also support our channel at no cost to you. So go ahead and click that link to grab your copy of the book and dive into an exciting reading journey. Happy reading and thanks for your support.